Hi everybody, this is Adam Russell, Global Resource Broker, coming at you on October the 29th at around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. I wanted to provide an update and I wanted to cover a couple of key things. And number one is I want to thank Jade for uh, having me become a moderator and, and work with her in the group that she created. I know that uh, most of you don't know this, but when, when Laura first, um, I would say, come off went offline, multiple different groups had uh, moderators go in and they were rogue and they changed the names of those groups. And Jade was one of the, the supporters and or top investors that was willing to create a, um, an update for everyone, which is this right here, which is Laura Creator and Faker Group. And as you guys can see, I'm going to go back here real quick. She actually created this and provides all positive updated information all the way back from when she created this. And so you guys can see that this has been updated, you know, all through October and from before. And a lot of the different updates from the event that was in Vietnam and so on. And one of the last things that I actually created and she actually posted was information in regards to what's going on from a technology perspective. And I'm going to bring that down to layman's terms for everyone so they can understand what's really going on. But I also want to show you guys, in case you're not part of the group, this was an open uh, information in regards to just to share so you could not chat in regards to this particular group. There's 3.9 uh, thousand members. However, if uh, you click here, it says new clean group, that chat is we all love Laura. Laura and that is the main chat that um, I'm a moderator in and that is 3.4 thousand members. And that one is a clean chat, has about 25 administrators in it. And as you can see here, these are some of the guidelines in regards to the group. One of the other things you'll see is that there is multiple moderators. You see the stars next to the names? Those are all moderators that are in this group. And if you say anything in negative or you share too much information and try to spam in this group, you will be banned. This is watched 24 hours a day from people all around the world. Um, again, my name is Adam Russell with Global Resource Broker, and I'm located in Florida, uh, Miami, Florida, in the USA. So that being said, what I really want to dive into today is a little bit about this information here. So you'll see this posted in the group, and a lot of people wonder, well, what does this mean? Well, first of all, what is COINS? Well, COINS was a high-yield investment program that I know went out of business. So I know the site is no longer available. So what is built with .com? Well, built with .com is a simple uh, online technology company that looks at the information behind any website and sees what type of technology was used and if it's still in existence and if there is actually a server that's being worked on with that technology. The reason why it says built with .com and then it says dot us this coins.com. So if we click on that, it's going to bring us up to uh, builtwith.com and they're going to, it's going to look for coins. But what it's not going to find, it's not going to find any information about coins. And the reason that is, is because coins went out of business and their server is no longer active. So when this comes up, you'll see this. I'm going to zoom in. There's a problem with the lookup. You see here, it says operation timed out. Now we're going to dig into that a little bit more in one second. So if we go here, we're going to go to, we're actually going to go to Firefox and you're going to see here, I have already pulled up the coins server, so coins.com. Notice it says server not found. That means there is no server. That means there's no, there's no domain name server. It's called a DNS. Uh, coins.com is considered a domain. It matches to an IP address, which is then hosted on a server. A server is where the website is hosted. All the technology that supports that company would be shown here. However, there is no technology because the server is not found. Now let's go uh, to back to here and let's go look up Laura. So we're going to go back and we're going to look at Laura with me on built. And as you can see, there's a full blown technology profile. Now people are wondering, oh, when I go to the website, it shows that it is no longer online. Well, let me share something with you about that. So there's a difference between a site that is no longer online, meaning that the DNS or the domain name server cannot be found, and a site that actually has uh, technology still on it. So let's take a quick look over here at Lara. See what it says? It says an, in, an error occurred during a connection with Lara peer-to-peer -peer reports experience an internal error called SSL, secure socket layer error inter, inter 
internal error alert. Well, what does that mean? That simply means that we are not authenticated for an HTTPS or a secure connection, which means that in fact, they are working on the website and from a security perspective, they don't want anybody accessing Lara with .me because it's gonna take a high level of security once they do come back online. Now, I do wanna throw the disclaimer out there that again, we're gonna prepare for the worst and hope for the best. And of course, we wanna provide up-to-date information. That's why multiple admins have come together to try to be able to provide as much due diligence and research as possible. But let's go back into here real quick. And the reason why we're gonna go one step further, I wanna compare this to my website. Now, I am the CEO and owner of globalresourcebroker.com. And so I did a search on Built With Me on my website because I can control that because I know I'm the one who had it built with both my uh, technology team as well as by myself. And so if we click here, you're going to see all the technology that goes into globalresourcebroker.com. That's my company. And as you can see here, all the technology is there. Our server's live. These are all the technologies that we use. And as a matter of fact, if you go all the way to the bottom, you'll actually see that, that there's 74 active technologies on my server. And now... That's pretty impressive in regards to the fact that there's a lot going on on a server. But what a lot of people don't realize is that in order to run a website, it has to be put on a server. So there's a IP address that we both use. So I'm going to go back into there one more time. And I want you to see this. An IP address is simply the, the address underneath the domain, which in this case is globalresourcebroker.com, or it could be laurawith.me, and so on. So we're going to go back in here. And you'll notice I also use Cloudflare hosting, Cloudflare DNS. And these are services that protect in the event that my website goes down, the, the server is still hosting it for me, even though these are all the technologies for my website. And so that is the IP address that people are seeing. My actual website is based out of Panama and it's hosted through another company. Now we're gonna go back and we're going to click on Lara with me one more time from built with. And as you can see, they use the same thing. Cloudflare hosting, Cloudflare SSL. Now, at the moment, they are obviously working on high-level SSL or secure socket layer certificates. Well, at least this is the speculation is that they're working on the website and they're going to uh, one day soon roll out an online login portal that you'll be able to access. Now realize this, that the information that is shown here, and again, we want you to be able to be updated with the latest, greatest information. So this website here is telegram.me forward slash Laura underscore real news. And then you'll get this update that again, uh, Jade created this or some other admins. And this actually will give you the link so you don't have to be added as a member, even though any one of the admins can add you as a, as a member, anyone that's an active member of the, uh, the new website or the new group here, the new clean group right here can add you to this group here. And so I'm more than happy to do it. Obviously, uh, this is an easy way to do it. You can just go in there and that way you can be added. But you'll notice here, see how it says, add member well I need to add you as a member unless you have that link so I wanted to provide this update for you and I want you guys to know that there's a lot of people there's also the Laura worldwide group there's a lot of people that are, are providing information this is a, an update that I'm going to be providing up uh, this video and so there's about 900 members in this in this particular group and um, this is an invite only as well see add member uh, there's no link to this group. It's actually add only private invite. And so there's about 900 on this one, as, as you can see there. And then on the Lara creator, as I said, there's 3.9 thousand there. And then, of course, the We Love Lara, there's 3.4 thousand there. So we have a lot of support. There's even though it was 100,000 plus people when Lara, as a company, were no longer providing uh, information on the news channel. And the reason that was is because when somebody is a moderator of a group, that means that they actually can, in fact, uh, make changes in regards to the information or the name of a group. This is the official Laura News. It has 11,006.6 members. And so nothing has been updated because the 
the uh, owners, uh, again, uh, the multiple different technology people, as well as uh, Alex and so on, they're going to provide official news on either this channel or a new channel to be distributed to everyone so we can have uh, information. Also know that we opened up a, a actual group for the admins that we're all talking and trying to communicate the latest updates and research that we can provide. So with that, I just want to thank everybody for taking the time to listen to this quick update video. Again, today is, is uh, Sunday, October the 29th. I'm looking forward to uh, providing an update you know, within the next week. I appreciate everyone's time, effort, and energy, and the faith that you know, we're all coming together with a singularity of purpose, which is to encourage, support, and of course, be there for one another to see the rise of Lara in the future. And I want you everybody to take care, take charge, and we'll see you all at the top.